Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to launch your favorite Android apps directly from the notification tray. Now we've covered a similar app to this one in the past which was called Bar Launcher but that one has become a bit outdated now plus it lacked a few key options. The app I'm talking about here today is called Diesel and it brings some interesting features to the table like matching themes for TouchWiz since in stock Android, as well as a feature that always displays your most commonly used apps. To get this one going, just head to the Play Store and search Diesel, which is a free app by the way. Alternatively, you could use the link in step one of my full tutorial to skip straight to the download page. Then once you've got the app installed, go ahead and open it up to do some initial setup. From here, you'll see a quick walkthrough, and the main thing it tells you is that you'll need to enable Diesel's accessibility plugin to get the full functionality. So to take care of that, head to Android's main settings menu and select the accessibility option, then on the following screen, select the Diesel entry and enable it. Once you've got that part covered, you're ready to start adding apps to your notification tray. So open Diesel again and select the Home option. Now there are two ways you can handle this. First, you can let Diesel automatically add your most commonly used apps to your notification tray, and all you need to do for that is just enable this first option. But if you want to manually pick and choose the apps that will show up in your notification tray, just long press these icons at the top of the screen, then select any app from the following list. Then once you've got the apps part all sorted out, you can opt to apply a custom background with this little toggle, and if you do, you can change the background shape and color with the next two options. Beneath that, there's an option for enabling icon packs for your app shortcuts, and that will let you use any icon set you downloaded from the Play Store. But once you're done setting up your app shortcuts, back out to the main menu, then take a quick trip to the settings entry. In here, you can enable a second row of shortcuts and hide them from your lock screen. But the main thing I wanted to show you is this themes option. This lets you pick from a Samsung theme, an HTC theme, a stock Android theme, and several others, so the ongoing notification it uses will match your system UI. Once you've got everything set up to your liking though, you can exit Diesel and even forget you have it installed if you want to. From now on, you'll see your favorite apps anytime you expand your notification tray, so you can quickly launch them from any screen. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.